There was one interesting uh, story that I always love to tell. And uh, it has to deal with the painting Mother of Silence. Mother of Silence is a fascinating painting. And um, when I was going through Agnes's uh, letters and journals, uh, there were references to MOS, uh, just initials. And uh, I was somewhat baffled by that. Uh, of course, the person I turned to first was Bob Hillary, uh, because Cathedral City was so small at that time. There, there were maybe you know, 40 families, 50 families when uh, Agnes was living there. Um, and I asked Bob if there was someone that um, Agnes knew who had the initials MS, MOS, and he couldn't think of anyone. And so I was stumped. And what was so curious is that uh, Agnes cited conversations. She would say, you know, I was worried about whether I'd be able to finish such a painting, particularly Pluto, and I think that's mentioned in my essay, also called Alchemy. Um, and, she, uh, and, and she said, Mother of Silence, you know, said that I should persevere with it. You know, so here's someone who is talking to her, giving her concrete advice. Um, and I had no idea who this was. It was someone obviously very, very close. Um, so going through the papers, I had one of these revelatory moments when um, I saw a black and white photo, and it was a kind of strange Buddha-like painting, very symmetrical, uh, with uh, the figure had this kind of featureless egg-like shape. Um, and underneath, she wrote, Mother of Silence. And so I figured out who Mother of Silence was. Mother of Silence was not a person. It was a painting.